Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Infinite Division platform. Right now I'll be doing one such question that came in your JMN examination. So this question came on 27th August 2021 in shift 2. So let us see this question first. Question says, if force capital F, length L and time T are taken as the fundamental quantities, then what will be the dimension of density? Okay, so let density be D. So what is the formula of density in the terms of force as well as length as well as time okay so let let this be related as fa lb and tc so this is the relationship let it let this be the relationship of force length and time with uh, to get density okay and we also know that the density is nothing but mass per unit volume so what would be its uh, what would be its dimension dimension would be m l minus 3 so this would be the dimension of density we can easily put it over here so eventually we'll be getting m l minus 3 so this is the value of density that we are getting and the, what is the dimension of force force we already know that dimension is m l t minus 2 so the power of it is a okay that we have assumed now again what is the dimension l would be lb and t would be tc so we need not uh, write uh, different things over here so eventually the right hand side would become m a l a and l b is also multiplied with it so here also t must be equal to minus 2a okay and multiplied by t c so the right hand side would become m a l a plus b and t would become c minus 2a here it is m l minus 3 and t was 0 so equating or uh, the values of a b c from this right, uh, right as well as left hand side so we will be getting a as 1 don't you think because this uh, the power of m was 1 so a will must be equal to 1 and what about this a plus b is equivalent to minus 3 okay so a is already 1 so b would be equivalent to minus 4 also this t from t t relationship c minus 2a must be equal to 0 because left hand side must be equal to right hand side so the c would be equivalent to twice of a and c must be equal to a is 2 so c must be equal to 2 so this relationship the the relation of density with force length and time can can easily be expressed as f1 okay because a is 1 l minus 4 as well as t square so this is the relationship that we are getting so tell me which option is correct so the option first would be the correct options that we are getting okay so these are the questions which is related to dimension analysis for such type of question in on you have to remember the dimension formulas of each physical quantities i hope this question is clear to everyone thank you